Wake up, sleepyhead. The sun's been up for ages. Five more minutes, Mom. You're late, Bloom. School? Oh, no. Why didn't you wake me up before? Oh, the alarm didn't go off. Oh, no. I can't believe this. Hang on a sec. School's out. The alarm didn't go off because I'm on vacation. Oh, Mom, your joke is Bloom. not funny. Ah, uh, but you fell for it, didn't you? <laughs> I'm sleepy. I'm going back to bed. You should try to go to bed earlier, you know. You were up really late last night. I was reading. Fairies, myth, or reality. Oh, don't you ever get tired of these silly things. They're not silly, okay? Huh. Actually, now the school is over, you can help me in the shop. No. Good morning, sunshine. I'm not going to huh? spend my summer working in the shop. I wish I could go somewhere fun with my friends. When you're older, you can go wherever you want. How old is older? I'm already 16, Dad. Only 16. You are still my little girl. Dad, it's not fair. Listen, in a few weeks, we'll all be going to the beach like we do every year. But all my friends go on holidays by themselves. That would have been the best present ever. Well, speaking of presents, we've got a little surprise for you. Yeah, just a little something to help you get around Gardenia. Really? Thanks, Dad! Huh? Nice, huh? Uh, well, yeah, thanks. See? She doesn't know what to say. I don't know, maybe she was expecting something a bit more sophisticated? A bicycle with a speedometer, maybe? A scooter, Mike. But scooters are dangerous and they cost a bundle. We'll try to put some money aside. Maybe next year we can get her one. Oh, he'll never change. My dad will never let me ride anything faster than a bicycle. Hey, Bloom. Uh -huh. Vacationing in Gardenia this year? No, actually, we'll be going away very soon. The same old beach, huh? I'll send you a postcard from our vacation place. That'll give you a chance to see something <laughs> Hey, careful with that scooter. It's brand new, you know? Have a nice summer, Mitzi. See you at school. What a show off. Go on, Kiko, but stick around, all right? Kiko? Goodness, 
did you see that, Kiko? Uh, oh! Solar wind! <sighs> Go away, you villain, or you will feel the magic of the sun and moon fairy! <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness! Ah, your time's up, fairy! Good ah, heaven! Ghoulies, take the scepter! <laughs> ah, give me that scepter! <gasps> Not so brave now, are you? Let ah! her go! Huh? Hmm. Or else I'll... Wait, what am I going to do? <gasps> Get her! Get back! <laughs> huh? Did, did I just do that? Huh? Yeah! <laughs> Hands off, Kiko! Yes! Oh. Come here, I'll <laughs> smash you like a china doll! Uh, oh no! <laughs> wow, powerful! <laughs> Are you okay? Well, yeah. Now, I have my scepter back. You don't scare me anymore. Only returning the compliment, your beast. Again, Blondie. Thank goodness they're gone at last. Uh, uh, hey, are you all right? Answer me. We'd better go home now, Kiko. This girl needs help. Nut, come forward. So, you have failed. Not my fault, Your Highness. I had the scepter in my hands, but then this earthling girl appears and messes everything up. An earthling girl? Oh, but she was not your ordinary earthling. She's got power, this girl. She pushed back my ghouls just like that. Interesting. Describe her. Mm, well, let's see. She was a... Uh, your glasses, where are they? Uh, right here, Highness. Well, put them on, you dolt! A nearsighted ogre. How ridiculous. If only he'd wear his glasses, he'd be all right. Oh, will you stop defending him? An ogre with glasses looks kind of lame. Quiet! That girl could mean something to us. Oh, but Highness, don't worry. One of my ghouls grabbed this. It's a piece of that girl's clothing. To us, this is nothing. But to a hunting troll, it's an important clue. You see? Good. Then go back to Gardenia and find the girl. Mm. And this time, don't, don't let, let us down. down. Bloom, I'm not sure I understand. Could you run that by me again? I already told you she was attacked by some horrible creatures. She's some kind of fairy. Hmm, I see. You believe me then? No, I don't. I, I think we should call the police and take this girl to a hospital. No, no, huh? please, don't tell anyone. She's coming too. How do you feel, dear? Huh? I'm all right. Thanks for helping me oh, out. It was nothing. My name is Stella. Hi, Stella. My name is Bloom. Should we call your parents, Stella? Well, that would be difficult. I come from a place that's a bit far from here. Have you heard of Solaria? It's a kingdom far, far hmm. away. I'm a fairy, you know. I was trying to get to Althea Castle in the realm of magic, so Oh, I... but of course. I'm calling the police. It doesn't take a genius to realize that this girl is seriously out of her mind. Hmm. Hmm. 
Duh. All right, you believe me now? I saw her and I believe her. Those creatures attacked me and I was forced to land here. On your planet, your daughter saved my life. She pushed back the uh -huh. ghouls with an energy shield. Actually, I don't know how I did it. The fairy doesn't need to know how. She just does it, that's all. I'm a, a fairy? Of course you are. Don't tell me you're not. Have you registered for the new program at Althea Castle? It's the best school for young fairies like you and me. No, no. Stop talking nonsense, please. Ah, uh, here we are. Troll, do your thing. Ah. Find mm. that girl. Mm. This way. So, this is your room, huh? Wow. Did you draw these? Yes. They're amazing. Sorry, I'm a bit nosy. Oh, no, it's okay, Stella. I mean, huh? no, things are not okay. For instance, I still don't understand what happened in the park. Bloom, you used your powers to save me. You should be proud of yourself. In my world, magic is a part of life, and powers such as yours are perfectly normal. Is your world like that? Hmm. Is it? Yes, almost. But it's much nicer in here. It's so different. I guess it all depends on your point of view, Stella. I still can't get over what happened. Strong feelings such as fear have summoned up the wonderful powers that are in you. They were always there, you just didn't know it. It's just a question of concentration. With your energy, you could do anything. Watch. Okay, now it's your turn. Give them back their original shape. Uh, well, nothing. I can't do it. You should come with me to Alfia Castle. It's a school for fairies. A new session is about to start. You could learn to control your powers. And I'm sure you'd make an excellent fairy. Where is Althea? It's in the enchanted realm of magics. A place oh. beyond time and space where mm. everything is possible. If you want to see the school, I'll show it to you. This is a bottomless postcard. Watch this. Magic! Now follow me! She's not far. The smell is strong. There's another fairy. It's Stella. They're together. I just jump in like you? Whoa! Yes, hurry up before the gate closes. I've lost the scent. She's disappeared. Huh, fairies. It's totally ridiculous. <gasps> Mike, it's not ridiculous. It's true. Come on. Admit it. You and I both know that Stella is a real fairy, but you're afraid to believe it. Mike, if this is Bloom's true nature, who are we to stop her? This is Althea Castle. Nice, huh? I'm sure you'd like it here. But what about my high school in Gardenia? I mean, everything is happening so fast. Listen, think about it. I've got to leave tomorrow morning, with or without you. All right, I'll sleep on it. Now, how do we get out of here? Easy. All you got to do is jump up. Whee! Wait a minute! <gasps> the scent is back! They're in! This house! Good work, troll. They can't escape us now! We'll go in through the back door and take the whole happy family by surprise! Huh? Ah! Ah! What's wrong, Kiko? Ah! We'll play ah! later, okay? We're really busy right now. Ah! What? Hungry again? You just had your dinner. You're gonna have to wait a bit. What is that rabbit doing? Trashing the kitchen? Kiko, come here immediately. <laughs> uh -huh. Those 
girls must be around here somewhere. We're right behind you. <gasps> what? Now, let's settle this. Ring Dummy, you got beat by a cutesy blonde. Yes, but I'm no ordinary blonde. Bloom, we're outnumbered. We're gonna have to split them up. I have an idea. I'll take care of the ghouls. All right, Blondie. Want to see what me and the troll can do? If I were you, I'd get ready to lick my wounds. Know what I mean? Very well. Let's see what you two can do against that! Burning uh, time! Now what do I do? Uh, but... <laughs> I can't hear a thing. Huh. <gasps> Guys, I'm ready. Okay, let's take him to jail where he belongs. What's the rush? Don't you want to have a little bit of fun first? I wouldn't be so cocky if I were you. After all, this is only our first mission. <laughs> yeah! I rest my case. <laughs> Stay behind me! Sky, would you mind doing something? What? My turn! Bullseye! Yeah, well done, but it's not over yet. Girls. Huh? Okay, who wants to feel my blade, huh? See, I told you you could do it. Then I'm really a fairy. Of course you are, I'm never wrong. Finally, this one's over. <sighs> Blue, meet our four heroes. Huh? Riven, Prince Sky, hey. Timmy, <laughs> and Brandon, Prince Sky's squire. Hello. <clears throat> hey, you, where do you think you're going? Hmm? See you later! It would be easy for me to straighten up everything with a little magic. Thanks, but I prefer this one. Bloom's ready. You're sure about this, sweetie? Yes, Dad. I'm going with Stella to the Realm of Magics and Althea Castle. Call us as soon as you get there and let us know everything. I still can't believe we agreed to this. What if you get sick? What if you meet these monsters again? Well, if... Dad, I'll be careful, I promise. Bloom, we love you very much. And please come home as soon as the session's over next summer. We'll miss you. And I'll miss you both so much. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh, did you really think we'd let you go just like that? No, no. We're coming with you. Really? Wow. Thanks, Dad. This is so Duh, great. No sweat. And anyway, I really want to see this famous magic dimension you keep talking about. So... Stella, is it possible? Hmm. Well, the rules don't allow it, but as they say, rules are made to be broken. Are you ready? We were born ready. To magics we go! really 
does exist. You believe us now? Come on, we gotta go. Classes are about to begin. In the next episode, at Alfea, Bloom will discover a new life and amazing new friends. But in the magic dimension, she will also meet the witches from the School of Cloud Tower, the first problem she will have to deal with. Peace and magics will be threatened. <laughs>